Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Tuesday Tiny Tidy. Today I'm in my living room and I'm going to be tackling this space. The bookcase I brought up a couple months ago, I'll link that video in the description box and up in the icon, but the bookcase is just it's not working. It's a spot that ends up being cluttered and that I'm now that I'm going for a more minimal, cozy, cottage, simplified look in here, I am going to declutter it, take everything off, find new homes for the items that I love, donate the things that I don't need, and rearrange this space once again to see if it can be a little less cluttered and more minimal. If you're new to my channel, then hi, welcome, I'm Jen, and on my channel, I share lots of simplifying, minimizing, and decluttering motivation for you all. And today is Tuesday Tiny Tidy, which is an open collaboration that I participate in weekly. Every Tuesday at 3 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time, I collaborate with a group of amazing ladies here on YouTube. Sunday Dawn from The Helpful Home is our host and creator of this challenge. And we all share tiny tidies, which are jobs to that we tackle. They can be small, they can be big. We're just trying to give motivation and inspiration for you all. So if you enjoy that, definitely head on over to the playlist. I'll link it down below as well as Sunday Dawn's channel, always listed every Tuesday on my videos. So let's jump into it. I'll show you what the bookcase looks like right now and kind of share with you the ideas of what I'm thinking the space will look like. So the bookcase sits in between the uh, two sofas, the love seat and the sofa. And um, while I like it, it's really serving no actual purpose. I definitely am going for function over beauty and not worrying about what it looks like aesthetically. Um, I mean, yes, I still care what my decor looks like, but my main goal is to make sure it's functional and practical and works for us. And right now it's just a dust collector and it's driving me crazy. So I am going to clear it off and then we will, um, I think what I'm going to end up doing is originally I had planned on putting this piece of furniture out into the barn, into like the pool shed. It's chewed pieces, but it's what we have right now. And while Cooper's in the puppy chewing phase, I do not want to invest in any new pieces of furniture. But what I like about this, it has a drawer so we can put our remotes in there and Matt can put his game controller. It can go over in the corner. It can still host my um, ethernet box and stuff and hold the lamp, but Cooper still won't be able to get a hold of it. And I think it will be nice and practical and functional and work just a little bit better. I know a lot, of, a lot of the decor that I have here isn't going to work, but we'll make it work. Well, we'll figure out something. And if not, then I just don't need it because honestly, I don't need it. So I'm going to declutter this. hear my father's voice he would tell me to move on he would say I'll be just fine yeah he would tell me we have time time to laugh and time to heal a favorite song is on repeat drinking wine until the dawn
So this is what it's looking like now. I really, really, really like it so much better this way. I still want to do something different with this picture gallery wall that we have up there. Possibly update some of the photos. It's been a while since they've been updated. But I also need to get a little piece of wood to put between there so Cooper doesn't uh, scooch his way into there and chew our cords. But pillows are back on to the sofas. I took the mirror from there and put it in the dining room. That was a past video. I'll link it down below, but I probably will put it back and I'm toying with the idea of taking these planters down for a little bit. I ended up tidying up the rest of the living room um, since I had the time. Wiped down the TV stand, kind of minimized it and simplified it a little bit. I really like the way it's looking. Did the same for the mantle. I ended up putting the books that were on the bookcase onto the mantle because these ones I really, really like um, and will reference and I don't have a bookcase. So the desk, I put the chair back. We're going to see if, if we can do this because Cooper was chewing at her chair here, but that's puppy life for you. And I minimized the a piano top. And that's it. That's my Tuesday Tiny Tidy. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to check out Sunday Dawn's channel down below and the playlist as well with all the other people collaborating with me in today's Tiny Tidy. Until the next video, remember I love and appreciate you all. I hope you're staying safe and taking care and we'll see you in another video very soon. Bye everyone. Looks so much better now, doesn't it? Much better than my hair. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching everyone. Bye.